Hello everyone, I'm Eight Shades of J. Welcome back to Life is Strange 2. I hope everyone's doing well today. Let's just go ahead and continue with the story and... I mean, it's towards the end of this chapter, so I, you just know something's gonna happen. So let's find out, uh, how this goes. I uh, hope I don't look like a clown. I actually kinda get why they all wear tattoos. Should we talk to these people first before we take a dip in the toxic lake just... with... Fuck I think that. we should talk to people. Come on, let's give talk it to her. Hey, what's up? Oh no, uh, I meant to talk to Hannah. For your ass? It is your party, dude. I saw that bruise Big Joe left on Finn. So? so come on. What the fuck did you guys do? Oh right, she wasn't there. Can we party instead? I stole some weed. Daniel broke into Merrill's. Daniel kind of broke into Merrill's place while we got paid. Aw, oh, that's it? Give me a break. I was just showing off. I'm not a yeah, little Yeah, and now none of us got paid. No, little man. Okay. I like how he's just so proud of himself for fucking things up. Let's enjoy the night. Hear that, Jake? Time to party. I, yeah, Jake knows what really happened. Just... <laughs> Sorry. Stay here for long? Everything okay, Jake? You okay, Jacob? Sure. Fine. Why don't you go back in your tent? Cool. Okay. You sure? Just don't get too fucked up. I'm fine. Yeah. Just thinking. Oh, uh, yeah, that's what I'm worried about, bro. Well, I do. Okay. Let's talk later. Mm -hmm. I really don't want to leave Daniel alone. And Daniel just spacing out. Can we talk to Daniel? Hey, Daniel. What's up? Nothing. Just hanging out with my friends. Um, okay, okay, with your raccoon sweater. I'll cool, just cool. Be around. Come get me when you want to go to sleep. I can go to bed on my own now, Sean. But thanks. Fine. Whatever. Yeah. Yeah, I had to redo some of the dialogue just because uh, it hey, didn't guys. save. What's up? Oh yeah! Shout so out some to of this sounds familiar. That's why. Grab a brew, smoke a bowl. I'm so good. Thanks, man. I'm, I'm already bust. <laughs> you fucking lightweight. That's what you get for keeping all the coffee to yourself. Messing with you, man. Hey, dudes. I am drunk. No well, shit. I thought he was gonna say something like, "I have a Thor." Yes. What's up? Next stop, fuck Meryl, start drinking. So, what's the next stop for you two travelers? I want to go north. Ingrid wants to go south. To both. Oh, go south so we can go together. Fuck that. I want to see Canada. She go to takes ass. Yeehaw. At least you have a choice. Still going down Mexico way? Yep. One way. Won't mind being in that heat, though. This is summer compared to Detroit. Summer. I'm not sure if there's a point really... or any benefit to talking to everybody. Start drinking, fuck Meryl, talk later. Okay. I'm done. More beer yeah, I don't want to get you. wasted. Lightweight. We party for you, Sean. Yeah, talk later. rad, dude. You do that. Yeah, I don't want to get, like, super wasted because I don't... I don't trust Finn. Okay, and which way is... Can I toggle my light, please? Thank you. Which way is the lake? Was it this way? No, this Jeez. is Finn. Cassidy's crazy. So don't oh, she is down light this light way. Dude. So, wow, this is very smart. Yeah, let's just pass Finn, letting him know that we left Daniel all alone. Oh, no, I don't like this at all. We know what's going to happen, but I don't know why Sean just doesn't... He never learns, man. He needs to be more cautious. Was the lake really this far? I, I guess it was. It's... Everything looks so different at night. Sean! Come on! <laughs> she was just waiting... Like a creep. I thought... Didn't Penny say this was like a toxic lake? Is this... Is this smart? 
I don't think we should go in there. Skinny dipping, huh? I don't remember saying I was actually going to go this. in. It's freezing. <laughs> it's all in your head. Just don't think about it. <laughs> uh. Sure. Can we say no? Think. No way. I know I'm a loser, but Hey! What are you doing? <laughs> I'm way too cold out here. Sorry. <laughs> oh, oh no. Come on, Diaz. It ain't that bad. <laughs> loser. <laughs> We left her hanging so bad. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. If I didn't, if the back of my mind wasn't all about Daniel. Howdy, Sean. You should have come to the lake. It was I did play. go to the lake. I just didn't jump yeah. in with you. Not with frozen balls. <laughs> okay, city boy. Come with me. Got to swing by my tent. Oh, okay. Daniel's not there. Daniel missing. Hey, that... what's happening? Looks like you went for another swim. By yourself. Even by myself. <clears throat> Did you see Finn? He was with Daniel, but now I can't find him. I see. I we knew it. Didn't see anybody out there. Didn't but... we pass Finn? I didn't see no Daniel now. though. <sighs> Figures Daniel was with him. Just tell Finn I want to talk. Thanks much. Later. Sean. She knows hold something's up. up. Wait what? A sec. Why? What? We have to stop them. Let's figure out a plan first. We don't have time for that shit. We just need to go. We have to get to Merrill's before then. Yeah. Right. You have any like ideas? Shortcuts? Big Joe's trucks. I knew this was gonna happen. This is why this I wanted. So messed up. What's messed up about it? Daniel. You told Daniel a lot of things. Hey, get mad later. We got shit to do now. We should have told the rest. Well, no. Something happens. Fuck me. It's okay. Maybe we should have told Jacob at least, because he's them back. the only other one thank that knows about this. Cassidy. Don't thank me. I'm gonna kill Finn myself. Someone's gonna get hurt. Can we pick the truck? Somebody build a lock. Finn. Of Probably gotta check her car. One truck is missing. See? Mm -hmm. Those tracks are headed out. Yeah, well. Oh. At least they didn't wake Big Joe up. But if we do, he'll kill us, Sean. So let's not advertise. No lights, no noise. Yeah, so I don't have car, Daniel's power to, truck. like, do anything. We're taking the junkiest truck we could. Find okay. Do you, do you know what you're doing? Figures. Oh, of course it's locked. I'll check the other door now. Well, did she check the other door or not? Why is she gonna check the door that I just checked? Oh, she meant the other truck. You mean? Sean, I checked the car. All doors uh -huh. locked. Of course. Great. Keep what about around. this one? I would think that he would lock them, and they, we have to be careful too, because doesn't Big Joe have a dog? I don't think the other... I don't think this is going to be open. Yeah, I mean, what do we think? One door left to check. Cass, oh. check it out. So, all the doors are locked. Mm -hmm. But, we just got to get into one car. And I think I can get that truck started. You shitting oh, me? Gosh. My dad was a mechanic. He once showed me how to hotwire his tow truck. Just in case. Hot damn, Sean. I fucking love it. Plus, we could, uh, mess with all the other cars so Big Joe can't follow us. Oh. Love the way you think. We can find some things here to bust shit up. Great plan. Let's, let's get started. Make a sound. Damn, stop running into me, woman. Yeah, if only Daniel were here to help us. 
Which truck am I supposed to... The window? Oh, man, focus. We have to get into that truck. Yeah, why won't it let me focus on the window? Huh? What am I... How is this helping us at all? It's not help. Gate. Ah, it's... Oh! I was like, yeah, we need some tools, man. We can't do this with our bare hands. These there we go. These pigs sure don't care about this place. Okay, we searched there. There's nothing. Is there anywhere else I could get in? Like a ninja. I mean, I don't know what we're going to find in there. Ew. Maybe we can get in through here. Well, no the... way. Hmm. All right. Well, last piece of pile of junk. Jeez, come on. Give me something. Yeah, by the time we find anything, like Finn and Daniel will be long gone. Can we jump in the back here? No. Oh god, camera, camera. Oh, rat poison. Why am I smiling? What I do just to massage the knobs? What? Holy shit. That's why there's no critters around here. Hmm. There's nothing back there, I don't think. Is she helping or is she just walking around? Guess we won't be working here anymore. I get this as a weapon, just in case. Mm. Finn is so nice. fucking stupid. Yeah, yeah, okay, good. I'm glad we got that. We got a pipe. Because I think Fat Joe is going to probably wake up at some point. Nothing over here, man. There's got to be something, man. Come on. That's a toolbox, man. Uh, pick up. Why are you just taking it your time? Look. I mean, I guess that's it. We can't pick up anything else. What does this do? It's a fuse box, right? No, uh, that might make too much noise. Did we look in here already? Yeah, we did. Nothing. Okay. I just want to make sure we have all our bases covered. So which truck are we going to break in? Okay, I guess we're going to jack up this tire. Open the window with the screwdriver. There she blows. Damn! You made a big ass hole in there. With force open. No, why are we going to hotwire this one, though? We're going to break the engine? No, we don't need to do that. That takes too much noise. Break window? No. Force open. Right? You pick the lock, even though I seen Chloe do it with a screwdriver. Careful. It's going to break. A few moments later. Yeah, this has to work. Shit. Broken. What? What a piece of shit! What was the point of the screwdriver? It didn't do anything. Honestly, I don't know what we're supposed to do. Fuck! Let's get out of here quick, Sean. Oh, fuck it. Let's rush. Come on. Oh get in. well. All right. Well. Oh, fuck! 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 I'm sure there was a better way how to do this. What the hell? He'll be in any second now. Uh huh. This is my first, second time doing this. Fuck, Sean, you did it. Yeah. Let's okay. We'll here. stop celebrating. Let's Drive. go. Fuck this shit. We did it. It was so close. I don't think. Let's oh do God. 
Okay, he didn't even come out. I think when I had the screwdriver, I should have went in that little lock shed, which I kind of forgot about when I had the screwdriver. I think that's what you're supposed to do, and there's probably a different thing in there that I could have used. Oh well, it's fine. Shit at all. Well, yeah. lock their truck with our truck. With. If we make it, don't say that. Finn's a shithead, but he is a good thief. Plus, he's got Daniel. Yeah, that's what scares me. Yeah, because Daniel is just head over heels for Finn. Yeah, not even be inside yet. No, they're probably in there. We took so freaking long to get in this truck. Oh, Finn is out of control. Yes, uh, I would put the light out. Fuck us over. Not like this. Why now? Because Finn thinks Daniel is his golden ticket. He just gets greedy. I'm stupid. We gotta catch him. Yeah, I just want to see if there's anything. What is this? The rat poison? Yeah, I kind of wanted to tamper with their truck so they can't take off, but... Shut Meryl up. lives here, right? Okay. Promise. How? What's Meryl gonna do if he catches them? Finn's a smart one. Kill us. He'll find a way out of this. I know. Of course, there they are. But we're in no rush, right? L let's take a look around real quick. Uh, we can't disable this. Come on. Maybe we can stop them before they fuck up. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure Meryl didn't see the, the, the flashlight in his window. Yeah, I don't think, maybe there's nothing. I was hoping to find maybe something. This is gonna go, this is gonna be bad. Ah, oh, shit. You scared the shit out of me. Good. Don't give me that, Finn. <laughs> Wait, Meryl! Finn, no fucking way. Come on, Sean. Are you kidding me? How could you do that, Finn? And you're some fucking kid. He's nine years old. He asked me for it. I didn't force him, man. Are you an idiot? Yeah. He's too young you're the to adult, though. Decision. Fuck's sake, Finn. He's an old soul. He knows what's up. No, he doesn't. Look at that Hold fucking on, smirk. Please. You're standing near a boatload of cash. We can do this in five minutes, in and out. Yeah. Then you're off to I'm sure you've been staying out here longer than five minutes. Me ever again. We got this, man. Trust me. Just punch no, him and leave. Please. No, Finn. Meryl is right fucking there. Uh, yeah, we shouldn't be arguing, locked. like, right here. Even know. Grab the kid and go. We could get out of here. Go to Mexico. Can we tell him no? And backhand him? He no. Said, no fucking way, Sean. Please. We're done, Finn. Come on, Daniel. No. Why should I? We couldn't even find you before. Yeah. You were with her, right? Who gives a shit? Let's go. Now. No. I'm sick of all this. For weeks. You just hang out with her. Oh my gosh. It's all your fault. This is so stupid. I what I want. A real adult wouldn't like bicker about such petty shit. The fuck are you doing here? Shit. Shoot him. Don't move. Don't shoot. What the fuck? How many are you? Just us. It's just us. Why would we rush in knowing that he had a shotgun? Move I would have like there. kind of like snuck around in the now, back. Uh, Meryl. Uh, <laughs> Boss, I know this looks bad, but... Stop. I don't want to hear any more of your shit. He has a right to shoot us, man. So, what was your big fucking plan exactly? Surprise party? Work here for a time and then break into my safe? Pathetic. Who was the moron mastermind? Finn. Like I didn't know. I gave you punk's work when nobody would. A place mm -hmm. to crash for free. God damn it, Finn, I told you- Shut up! This is how you repay me? Stealing from me? Uh, no, no, it's not about- Yeah, you. shoot him. I thought you were different. Smart. I've came for my bro, dude. We're getting a kid involved. 
and you're teaching him how to steal? Thief and brother of the year. Nice. What now? You all really fucked up. I can't just let this slide. I can't. You're young, but you can learn from mistakes. That doesn't mean your lesson's gonna be easy. Or painless. Hey, it's me, boss. Everything all right? Ah, uh, see? Yeah. How did he get here so fast? Come in. Damn, Kratos. These dumb fucks didn't even mess with the cars to stop me. Bet they got their plan from a TV show. I thought I popped the tires, did, did I not? search them? Nah. Go ahead. Yeah, they don't have anything, right? Uh, yeah, they're clean. Yeah, I mean, we didn't even get a chance to steal. Okay. On your knees. Hands on your head. Shit, don't do this. Don't shut up and do it. Well, Come on, uh, sir. hey, adult Daniel, this is the time to use your powers. Talk. I'm serious. On your knees. Now. Sean, just get shot. You had a good run. You don't need to suffer anymore. What are we going to do? What's there to discuss? Don't worry. We're on our knees, okay? Yeah, this is the second time we had to get on our knees. No. You deaf asshole. Finn, just do it. Finn's don't hoping that Daniel will do his... Now, kid. Daniel, you got this. Yeah, don't see? Move. Just get on your damn knees. Yeah, now. Mm. Don't fucking move. <laughs> oh. Uh, you deserve uh, that, Finn. He ain't going nowhere. So Finn, is this how your plan, you know, played out in your head? Probably not, right? It's not like I want to do this. The people I deal with are worse. But if you rip me off, you rip them off. Then I... Daniel's like frozen. I have a family to look after too. I gotta protect them first. Is he gonna shoot Finn? Can't let you play me anymore. You shot. The thing is, at this point, like, we're gonna be shot and killed. Right? I mean, if we do nothing, but then again, we're like the main. Or do we let Finn die? What do you think will happen? I'm torn. If we let Finn die. I don't think Meryl's gonna stop there. I think he might just go for Cass and... But then if Daniel uses his power, is he gonna kill Meryl and... and Big Joe? And do we want that? Suppose we do nothing. Am I gonna regret this? We weren't even supposed to be here in the first place. No. We need to get rid of Finn. Please, boss. I know. I got greedy. I, I was high. Stupid. Shotgun, I, though, to the face is just I nasty. Know. Finn. You will. Is he really going to do it? No way. He's going to do it anyway. Shit. You little brat. Get out. Run. Okay, we have to kill him for sure now. He, they know his power. Oh gosh, you know that hurt. That's all. That's all bone. That's all skull. Oh. <laughs> what happened to your power? Okay, they're dead, right? How's that bullet feel, Daniel? He's in pain. That's why. Uh, well, don't smash us with you, man. He's in pain. Oh no. He's gonna rip the whole house apart. Uh... So the question is, who survived that? Obviously Sean survived, right? 
They wouldn't kill Sean off like that. Meanwhile, now we have to worry about Daniel. He got shot. I gotta get the bullet out. Oh, that kid. I hope this is an eye-opener for him, though. It's like, you say you're an adult, but you couldn't even handle the situation properly. Oh, no. But now I think, I mean, we have to kill Meryl and Joe if they're not already, because they can't know about Daniel's power. That's the wrong, that's the wrong people to know. Okay, well, there's Joe. I don't see him breathing, so I think Joe is dead. What about Meryl? Is he moving? They didn't all die, did they? That would suck if he killed everybody. Where's Sean? This idiot. Well, there's some money. A ten dollar bill. Where is Sean and Daniel, though? Oh, my gosh. Please let that not be Sean's blood. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. I got a bad feeling. I have a bunch of glass on me. That's not a good sign. Wait, is that glass in my eye? All right, let's see what choices we made. So we did the minority decision here. You didn't make more coffee after drinking the last cup. I didn't even know you could do that, to be honest. Oh my gosh, what a bit rude bitch I was. Uh, let me see. You hit the target while knife throwing. You hit a bullseye. You didn't hit the target while the knife throwing. Okay, that's good. So would most of us, or at least all of us, have some good aim or decent aim? You try to be understanding what Daniel mentioned Karen. Yeah. You asked Daniel why he doesn't wear his watch. Hell yeah. You didn't call Big Joe out. Oh, so 73 of you guys were, were brave. Yeah, I didn't want to like ruin anything. I'm like, dude, the guy has like a freaking gun. I got nothing. Your trimming was average, 75%. Well, that's not what Meryl said. Meryl said that my trimming was, like, fantastic. Game's lying. You didn't help Daniel with his chores. I asked, no, I'm pretty darn sure I asked him if he needed help, and he rejected me. That's not true. You were sober at the campfire. You went to sleep with Daniel, yep. You, Finn came forward with Daniel hit Big Joe. You came forward when Daniel hit Big Joe? Oh, yeah, no, I'm fine with Finn getting the black guy. You were out for the heist? 51%. 28% of you guys are really willing to use Daniel for a heist? Jeez. And 11% of you guys wavered? Shame on you. You and Finn remained friends. You and Finn cr kissed? You could, you could romance Finn? Gross. You chose to have a wolf tattooed. Yeah, but I regretted that after seeing Cassidy's uh, handiwork. That did not look like a wolf, man. It looked like it was diseased. You didn't follow Cassidy for a midnight swim? Nope. Cassidy didn't get angry at you. Wait, why would Cassidy get angry at me for not jumping to the lake with her? You didn't kiss Cassidy. I didn't- I suppose if I jumped the lake with Cassidy, I would have gotten that option, but I didn't. You didn't enter Cassidy's tent. Well, we didn't really get a chance to. You woke up Big Joe and he went after you. Sabotage. So I guess I was supposed to sabotage the engine. Damn. I thought that I thought I thought sabotaging the tire was enough. You came in after Finn and Daniel broke into Meryl's house. You snuck into Meryl's house without being noticed. That's what I wanted to do. I don't know why they just jumped right in the front. You alerted Meryl while sneaking into the house. 
I guess there was a way to sneak in. Damn. You didn't take the gun from the safe. I could have taken a gun from the safe. I guess you had to sneak in Meryl's house first, right? You did nothing and Finn wasn't killed. Oh, Finn could have died. You told Donald to use his power and Finn wasn't killed. Fuck that, man. You shot Meryl. Damn, if I only had the gun. Cassidy was injured. Oh, man. Daniel didn't wait for you. Yeah, why was that? I don't understand. Like, I've been nothing but nice to this kid. Daniel refused to help dishes. Yeah, he didn't want me to help him. Daniel refused to help with the water tanks. I didn't ask him. Daniel talked with Sean about his anger. Daniel disobeyed, used his power, and got injured. Yeah, little punk. But lashed out after Finn died. Oh, I see. So I guess it wasn't a terrible ending. This is it, son. Your toast. Huh? Who's toast? End of the I road. like toast. No way out this time. We got a lot of room in jail for cop murderers like you. You're Excuse alone me? now. Alone. Wait, did I get arrested? All right, guys. That's going to end it for this episode. I know this might be shorter than the other ones, but I mean, I just kind of wanted to digest what just happened. So it looks like So I don't know what I went what I did wrong with Daniel. I must have maybe the chosen the wrong dialogue options, I don't know, cuz that kid's no not listening to me anymore. And I'm trying to like all I'm trying to do is protect him. And uh, I don't know what's going to happen. I don't even know what the ending of this of this chapter was all about. Like, is a cop talking to me? Was I arrested? It kind of seems like I lost an eye, too. Like, I don't... From, oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm sacrificing... Sean is sacrificing so much for Daniel. If he loses... If he loses an eye... I would seriously... I don't know, man. Anyways, if you enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe. We'll continue with the next chapter, a brand new chapter, uh, and go from there. Hope you enjoyed. Until next time.